I will maybe put um, a gallon or two of seawater into a 250 gallon tote of water um, with some humates. So it's, I mean, it's, it's, it's pretty dilute concentration. With some what? Humates, liquid, humates, humates are, is a, it's a, it's a mined material. It comes, it basically is between peat moss and coal in the geological profile. When they do a mountaintop removal in West Virginia, they push the whole mountaintop into the hole the valley to get to the coal, a lot of what they're pushing off into the hole is these humates, this uh, brown coal, uh, linardite, it's called, um, it's a... Where can you get something like that? Um, <clears throat> well, sourcing amendments is the... Mm -hmm. <laughs> 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 a question that somebody had to give the break. I was hoping to get to. Um, uh, humates, um, did I, I'm sorry, I finished answering your question, right? yeah. I'm continuing to answer the question. Um, you would use humates, I said you could use molasses or sugar or um, or biochar, anything that's a carbon compound. Um, humic acid, fulvic acid, these are things that are, are you know, pulled out of humates. Um, we talked about organic matter before. I said that you know, compost will, has a lot of organic matter, but it'll oftentimes oxidize into the atmosphere, turn into carbon dioxide. Um, humates are, um, so uh, humus, humus is a really interesting compound. Um, humus is that which makes your soil dark in color and rich and vital and uh, humus has a long shelf life, a, a half life of you know tens of years if not hundreds of years. It doesn't break down easily. It's a byproduct of fungal digestion as I understand it. Um, <clears throat> um, compost may have a half a percent humus or one percent or one and a half percent humus in it. Uh, humates are 70, 80, 90 percent humus. So they're a much more concentrated form of humus. Um, and you can buy them by the ton, buy them by the bag, you can buy humic acid.